so, and, and you'll find that this is this is true in um, the audio industry and, and the game industry as well. But um, people tend to work more than an eight-hour day, uh, and, and so during this period, um, I had about four hours of meetings every day, um, and, and you know, you'd get up, you'd. Uh, check your email, you'd go through your 200 emails in your inbox from the night before. Um, and then we had uh, what's called a stand-up meeting. We use the Agile software. We use Scrum process. So we'd have a 15-minute meeting, talk about you know, the progress um, on all the user stories. If you don't know about Agile and Scrum and you want to be a software development or be in software development, you should look it up because almost every company I know of is using it to some extent. Um, and then, you know, I'd get a couple hours to code and, uh, then it's, um, you know, back into meetings, um, a lot of design meetings. Um, I was managing a team of 19, so I also had management meetings. Um, and then most of the coding that I got to do on AX was, uh, at night. So I'd go home, put my kids to bed and I would start coding again until about midnight. Um, and Turns out that somewhat overlaps with some of the people who were in the geographic locations I was working at, so it actually kind of worked out. Um, but, yeah, but yeah, that was sort of my role and my team's roles. 